Um, the biggest strains and pressures I personally face with four teenage children is um, making sure that my children are not spending too much time on computer, internet-y equipment and feeling that things like Facebook, um, Snapchat, Instagrams, the last two items being fairly new to me and I think to the children, um, seem to be all-encompassing and can almost be compulsive that they need to be checking what's going on. On top of that, it's the fear that there is um, peer pressure with, um, if they write certain things, it can be misconstrued at the other end, and then it causes all sorts of angst and upset, and it's the whole being hooked on social media, twittering, tweeting, blogging, it's endless, and it seems to take over uh, their playtime sometimes, and it concerns me, especially the teenage daughters. Um, what I do do is I police to a certain extent what gets said and sometimes I hear from other people that are perhaps more on these social media. I do have a Facebook account myself and my children are friends with me so I can see what's written uh, but I'm not always looking at it. It's not something that I do too much. So. Um, when I see something that I feel is the language is uh, inappropriate or um, it's just over the top in my, um, in my view, I will speak to my children and ask them to remove things or I'll try to explain to them writing things in a certain way. They may find it funny but actually it can be very hurtful or just trying to help them when they've been hurt by things that are made and I, I'm just trying to encourage them not to see that as the centre of their lives and not to be hung up on it and really to try and distance themselves and be very careful. Um, so it's really me speaking to them more than anything else.